Hi, I'm Frank Lee Ruggles, and I'm a National Parks photographer. I love the Moab area because it's one of those places that if you wait five minutes, it'll look different. As the sun tracks across the sky here, you get a different look minute by minute because there's so much texture and there's so much color here. Everything is always changing. You always have something beautiful and interesting and compelling to shoot in the area, whether at your arches or Canyonlands or Dead Horse Point, you never run out of things to shoot. If you're one of those folks like me that can get up at four o'clock in the morning and, and be on location to watch the sun wash over the landscape and watch the colors start to appear right before your eyes, the reds come out of the oranges as the sun hits them and then they wash into yellow and it's, it's magical. There's no place like Moab. There are four things you should know before you head out on the trail. There are four simple things. Number one is you should know yourself. You need to know what you're capable of. You don't want to take on a hike that's beyond what you can do physically because if you get out there and get exhausted, you not only put yourself in danger, but you put the people who have to come rescue you in danger as well. Number two is you need to know the trail itself. It's good to do a, a internet search on what the weather and terrain are gonna be like so you know what you're getting into. Unfortunately, I've seen people on really challenging trails wearing flip-flops on their feet and they've gotten themselves into trouble and have to be rescued. So you wanna know the trail, not just where it goes, but what kind of obstacles, mosquitoes, how bright the UV index is gonna be so that you keep yourself safe. Number three is you wanna know your gear. As a photographer, when you're standing watching the most beautiful sunrise come up, that's not the time to be looking through your instruction manual to try to figure out how to change the aperture. You wanna use your downtime to learn your gear so when you're out of these beautiful places, you're ready to shoot. And number four is you wanna know the deal. The deal is, we're visitors here. You wanna leave it better than you found it. You don't carve your name into a tree. You don't uh, leave graffiti anywhere. You don't litter. In fact, if you see litter, you pick it up. So you want to know yourself, know the trail, know your gear, and know the deal. You remember those four things, you're going to have a great experience in the national parks.